Hello, it's Russ LeBlanc, NEC consultant for ECNM Magazine. And in this video, I'm going to be taking a look at this damaged cord you see here. And if we take a look at the other end, we'll see that that's also damaged. Right there. But the both ends are pretty bad. So what we end up with is a couple violations. One being section 400.12 number 7. A flexible cord is not permitted to be used with subject of physical damage. This is clearly damaged. I don't know how it got damaged, but it is nonetheless damaged pretty badly. Also, uh, in similar fashion, section 110.12b states that there shall be no damaged parts that may adversely affect safe operation of equipment. And I would certainly say that this broken cable jacket and the damaged conductors would affect the safety of this equipment.